Rosie. Bottas to Red Bull, Russell to Merck, Alonso to Renault. Someone, just tell us, please. Yeah. No one's made an announcement, and no I'm one knows stewing. What We're in lockdown. Going on. This is the perfect time to give us a little bit of entertainment when the race isn't on. But Renault yeah. are now saying mm-hmm. they're not going to tell us anything until the season's began. Is that what they said? Mm-hmm. Oh, I didn't hear that. Mm-hmm. Wait, so until oh my god, until whenever the first race is, <gasps> that could be months. That is going to be months. Hopefully, be next month. At least c- June. Yeah, didn't they say that? I thought it was July. Oh, maybe July. July. Oh, no. It's two months. I thought we were in June. Kind of. <laughs> we're we're in a week away. Oh, God. Um, Ooh. Oh, yeah. Christ. Right, so. Oh. <clears throat> yeah, so they're not announced until the season starts, which. That's. That's, that's kind of bored me because I don't care yeah, about like, it. But do you, like, when you, you t- want to like get people excited? Yeah, but realistically, like F one fans, I feel bad for them. Like, reali- realistically, give them sign. When the racing starts and there's something going on, I don't give a shit. He feels the Renault seat, it's the most boring seat in the fucking thing, really. <laughs> yeah, I don't give a that shit. That is so true. Yeah, but that is so true. What would be cool? There's speculation. There's all speculation that Bottas is in touch with Red Bull, and there's also speculation that Vettel may be taking Bottas' seat. In Mercedes. Mm. More about mm. that mm. later on. Mm-mm-mm. Right. Um, also, it's been in the news today that McLaren are to cut 1,200 jobs. The Seems McLaren so Group, hard. this is. Um, which is, qu- what, what does it say? One quarter of its entire workforce they are laying off. Um, that includes about 70 people from their Formula One um, oh, wow. workforce. So their Formula One workforce is 800 strong. And they're losing about 70. Aww. So they've actually not been hit as bad as the rest of the thing. Mm. Um, yeah, this, so... That's so sad, especially in today's climate. Yeah, you've got a speech from like, the chairman there, haven't you? Paul Walsh, executive chairman of McLaren Group, said, We deeply regret the impact that this restructure sorry big word the impact of this dyslexia has on me (laughs) (laughs) will restructure will have on all our people but especially those whose jobs may be affected it is my brain it is a course of action we have worked hard to avoid but already undertaken dramatic cost-saving measures across all areas of the business but we now have no other choice but to reduce the size of our workforce. This is undoubtedly a challenging time for our company and practically, oh, pat- <laughs> particularly our people. But we plan to emerge as an efficient, sustainable business with a clear course for returning to growth. Hmm. That is quite worrying though, because... <clears throat> right there is no way anyone could have planned for this this is the weirdest thing there's all these companies that are like mm. these absolute powerhouses in the industry Renault the, 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 was it the French minister was warning Renault could disappear if they had they, I think they're setting up like a five well, a billion company. yeah in general right shit and they're setting up a five billion bailout for them or something like that which to be fair they would never have, it's not that this is pure corona Bought on by Corona. There's That's no the saddest demand. thing. The cars, is the, there's no one yeah. buying cars. Yeah. Who's buying a McLaren at the moment? Realistically, no who's one. spending over hundred yeah. grand on a car? Even if you had money, even if you have it, you're not spending. You're not it. spending it, are you? you can't Especially go on a McLaren. Where, where, yeah. where, where are you going to go? Yeah, no. Nah. Um, which sort of backs up my point of we need to get things going. Otherwise, this is going to be way worse than Rona could ever. The damage done from this well, is going to kill way more well, than Renault could think, ever done. Do you yeah. want to know how many people work for Renault? Yeah. Right. 180,000 people work for Renault worldwide. Worldwide. Yeah. Wait, so are they... McLaren only have 3,700 people working for them, so put that into perspective. Wow. Right, imagine Renault folded wow. as a company. It's probably unlikely, but imagine no, they but folded as a company. That's a scare. Well, you just you don't 180, know, 180,000 do people could be out of the job. That is insane. And then where are they, where do those and people go the only car to get jobs? In, yeah, and they're not the only car manufacturer in trouble. That's the thing. It's, and who's yeah. going to hire them? That's the thing because everywhere else is especially if everywhere else is doing the same thing. If their skill set is cars, they need to work with cars. Yeah, no there's one's a lot hiring. of people. No going, one's hiring. Yeah, no one. We need to get it going. 
this is going to be way worse than Rona could have. I said this at the start, so we need to make sure that locking down isn't going to affect more people than well, it already has. ever could. It already has, and it is. It has, but, but making people homeless is possibly going to... That yeah, could kill more scary. people than Corona ever will. Yeah. So we need to get things going again, I think. I think it's time. The numbers have dipped a lot. We, I think it's cautiously yeah, but that's time. that's true to us being in lockdown. Yes, but I think we're low enough now and we could take the precaution that I don't think it's going to be a huge risk. Weighing up the risk of losing all these massive companies. Well, I mean, companies. we are in the motion of doing it, though. Yeah, but yeah, exactly. But we need to speed this process up and we need to make sure there is formal. Yeah, but they also need to year. make sure that, yeah. They do, but... I know what you're saying, but the, you will, the, you know... It's a lot... It's going to be worse if we yeah, don't 100%. get this moving. Because imagine a hundred... Imagine Renault go down. That would be insane. That is crazy. It's fudged. <clears throat> yeah. Um, so anyway, other in other news, Lewis Hamilton has said he's considered leaving Formula One. Dun, dun, dun! Oh, so you got a statement there. So he filmed a video, or he did an interview or whatever, earlier this week, and he said, I have days... I have days when I wake up and feel groggy, but I don't feel motivated to work out. I feel, jeez. Jeez. <laughs> where, jeez, man. You know when where you read going? that out of context? Like, when you were saying it, it was probably like, when you read jeez, it's funny. <laughs> jeez, man. <laughs> I feel, jeez. Where are we going? What's next? Should I continue racing? I think all these different things, and then I'm like, damn it. And the next hour or whatever, it passes, and I'm like, damn, I love what I do. Why would I ever consider not continuing? So he is going to be... Whenever you read quotes, it sounds really funny. Yeah, so is he? Damn. So he isn't leaving. And he was never going to. And the newspapers He's... made a big deal out of this. When Wait. really, nothing was happening. He's just having doubts. Who everyone does. What doubts in terms of, like, next year? I don't know. Just leave, uh, him, leave stopping racing I was going to say, surely he's still got time. He's in his prime. Like, I don't know. He's not he, prime. He, don't know he, he says that. He was never seriously considering Well, because isn't he like... So say if he wins this year, <coughs> does he have more... What's the thing? What do you mean? Who? Well, he, his contract's up at the end of this year. He's not going to... He's he ain't going on. nowhere. There's, there's realistically, he's just taken his sixth title. Is he realistically going to quit? That's what was I'm saying. Was he still world champion when he could beat all records? Mm-hmm. That's what I was talking about. There's yeah. no way. There's no he way. He just wouldn't do it. <clears throat> He'd be a fool. Lois Hamilton's not lead it, leaving everybody. He's not. he's not. Now, for the full length show, head over to Podbean and if or Apple Podcast. If you're already listening, stick go with us. Apple. Um We'll be talking about Silverstone and whether that will go ahead, giving more driver lineup predictions and just general chit chat. For that, click the links in the description or search the front runners. E- no, <laughs> search front runners F1. Yay! Do that. Yeah, do that. <laughs>